Hi, it's Ashley from AB Sound Advice. Today we are doing a product preview of the DD Audio DSi-3. This is a digital signal interface. Now, if you're not familiar with the DD range, um, there was the DSi-2 that had been around for a few years, and this is the brand new model called the DSi-3. Now, the main difference is, of course, compared to the old one, you had to buy a Bluetooth module separately. Now, with the new DSi-3, we have Bluetooth built in. Now, this is a fantastic product. So first off, what we'll do is I've just got the um, the booklet here. So again, so new, there's not a lot of information on this. So it's a PC and smartphone graphic user interfaces. So effectively, you'll be able to, you can um, do the tuning through a, um, a computer or through your phone via an app. It's 31 parabolic um, graphic equalization, crossovers and time, time alignment. Bluetooth compatible, which obviously it's got the Bluetooth doggle. There also is a remote control, um, which is optional, which is the DSI-3RMT, and I will show that to you later on. Um, you've got six customization um, for EQ presets, six channel high level inputs, six channel low level RCA inputs. It's got input simming and 12 channel low level RCA outputs and of course the aluminium case. The software can be accessible from the DD site, so if you'd like more information, just duck onto ddaudio.com and just um, search DSI 3. Some of the cool features will operate between uh, 9 and 9, uh, sorry, 8.7 volt through to 16.5. The high level impedance is 240 ohm, RCA impedance is uh, 20 um, K ohms. And of course, RCA output is 50 ohm, and your output voltage is 2. Point, uh, sorry, 0 0.2 volt to 5 volt. And um, just looking through, obviously you've got the memory output, um, input channels, we've got 6, output channels 12, the graphic that we talked about, and the dimensions 191 by 107 by 39. And... Um, that's quite a, as, as I said, a very, very nice unit. So let's, the other thing I will mention before I pull this off, inside the, inside the actual unit, you can take the top off. There is jumper leads inside the unit that you can make adjustments to suit the vehicle. It is a very cool unit. I mean, the, the DSI-2, we never, there was hardly very hard to find them. They just, every time they arrived, they were sold. So now we have the brand new DSi-3. So let's take a quick look at the unit. So bringing it up close to the screen here, you can see we have channel two through. So you can see that you've got channel um, one, two, and you can see right through, labeled right through to channel 12. You can see that little antenna, that's your Bluetooth antenna. There's the front of it. We'll spin it around the other side. For the input side, as we mentioned, the high end, you've got a switch to decide which way that's going to be optical, the PC connection, and the remote, which is optional. And again, you can see there's a little adapter. That's your little plug that goes into the side there. So, very nice unit. We'll also have a look at the loom. You'll see on the loom here what they've done. They've terminate, terminated the, um, the actual speaker cables into RCAs. So you can, as I said, you can use the the high or the low output. So I'm guessing if you don't use the RCA connections, you would just use the speaker connections. And of course, you've got your powers, earths, and remote for turning it on. It also comes with the PC Connect. So obviously, you can plug straight in to do all your settings. It comes with a white, uh, little screw kit, which you can just see there. And what we'll also do is now, I'll also show you that this is the optional remote, which is the DS i-3 rmt and there's the remote control and i'd say that in this part of the world um the unit's just over a thousand dollars which is the dsi-3 and these things are about 95 through to 109 dollars and i think it's worth adding on it just means if you if you want to you can have a little control that can be mounted anywhere you like it can be double-sided or wherever you want to put it um just gives you a bit of extra control from a remote and i think that's a great idea so i'll just pop that the way so that's for the dsi dash r sorry 3rmt which is the optional remote control so if you'd like to find out more information about the the dsi dash 3 you'll find that on ddaudio.com and as i mentioned before it is a fantastic product and the good thing with this you can um, it's not only you can do it through the computer once you've got it loaded on 
uh, the app on your phone. You can have the presets and you can just, um, in your vehicle, you can just go into the settings and adjust things um, from your mobile phone, which I think is a far better way of doing it. I've actually got a DSi Dash 3, uh, sorry, 2, sorry, in one of my cars already. I've used it. It is a fantastic product. Now, for the ones, this is probably more of a professional install. So you're going to need somebody to give you a hand or need a professional organization. Now, what I do in these difficult situations, um, you can just use an ICANN. So this is something I made years ago when I used to have a workshop. Whenever anybody had a difficulty installing something, I just handed them this, and it's called an ICANN. So if you ever get stuck and you're not sure what to do, just make yourself an ICANN, and that will certainly solve any problem. So just when you think you can't do it, um, yes, you can. <laughs> And anyone who's installing would understand that. I mean, these are a little bit complex um, as an install. Once you've once you've done a couple of these things, it doesn't take long to get used to it. And if ones who've already got a technical background, um, definitely not an issue to do, to work with. But this is mainly an integration unit. So if you've got a factory set up, and you, you know, and like how many times I've been down this road, I've always, when I bought a car, swapped my head unit. And um, today's modern cars, it's pretty hard to do that. So this allows. You know, us as people who really enjoy sound you can buy this unit leave your factory system in the vehicle and attach this onto it you can have your subs in the back swap your speakers out and you've got that high fidelity sound that you would get out of a high-end head unit without actually having to change your actual factory head unit so it's a, it really is a fantastic module and really this is probably the future for anybody who's looking for a high-end sound and you are unable to replace the factory head unit then definitely the DSi-3 is the way to go. So I hope you've enjoyed today's product preview. And again, thank you for tuning into AB Sound Advice.